Fist cook up, come with your laptop, come prepared. Sell yourself to the tastemakers that's in here. Rule number two, this is your time to motherfucking shine as a producer. It's all about you. Rule number three, play whatever. This is not a beat back. This is here for you to get that new wave out. And if you 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 feel like you next up, this is the place you need to be. Rule number four, never ever come in here with whack beat. Have everything mixed, have everything ready, and then prepare. Cause if it ain't, we're gonna ask you to open your door. You don't want that. I'm Cabana, um, from Pittsburgh, PA, and I'm here to play y'all some beats. Cabana, Cabana, bring that shit the fuck back. Bring that, bring that shit the fuck back. Bring that shit the fuck back. That was a wave. Like, I ain't, I don't really, really, I know, like, I ain't a lot of creativity to bounce. I ain't like, you come crazy. Thank you. I ain't a lot. Criticism wise, I ain't really got, like, mixing all straight for real. Like, bouncing everything. Like, so, like, samples. I don't know if you make your own samples or not, but, like, yeah. samples. Like, that last one, I made everything. You made that last one? Yeah. Hey, we, yeah, we gotta chop it up for real. Yeah, that last one is crazy. Yeah. I think the textures are beautiful, it's lush. Um, it's like you can hear all the layers of imagination, the panning of the snares. Only thing I would say is just find the artists who bring them joints to life. You know that's what I'm saying? What I've been that's the for. that's the number one thing. Like everybody make tight ass beats, but the marriage between beat and artist, that's the hardest thing. I love everything. The layers is there, your arrangements is there, musicality. I pay attention to the music a lot because a lot of people just don't hear. They don't have an ear to hear what they doing. Like it's a lot going on. I would like to hear you lock in with an artist. So what type of artist would you lock in with or some of the first ones? Like the first one you played, cause it kind of jumped genre. Like the switch ups was crazy. But it kind of went from like dance, house. Oh, yeah, yeah like it was switching up. I would just like to hear you lock in with an artist and what that would sound like. If you don't find an artist, get in with writers. I tell producers all the time, they like, how do I get to artists? How do I just collaborate with other producers? Yeah, I appreciate y'all for um, giving me criticism. Um, I really was looking for something bad. I'm very spiritual so what y'all hear is where I'm at spiritually my influence is the pain that I've been through and I just put it all on the beat mm. That's tough. And, and you're, you're doing all this in in, in fruit loops yes sir hey my IG is I am Cobana I am C-O-B-A and an H hey, y'all make some motherfucking noise I am Cobana y'all make some motherfucking noise Wave check, you up next, my G. What's going on? Uh, first, I want to say uh, thank you for letting me come over here. I go by Wave Check. I'm from Athens, Georgia. College student, you know, just trying to make it. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, my social, uh, Wave Check, you a fool. And he got waves. And I got waves. And I cut hair. Anybody need a haircut in the studio? I'm next. Come on. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Come on. Come on. Hard. It's the first one, the the, the sample selection. I like the drums. 
it's like the sample selection to me is like I've heard it, you feel me? Like yeah. a lot. It was just like the kind of like it was like the 4 PL, you feel me? Talking. Yeah. But it was like the drums on the hard, like your mix clean too. And like the second one, like that pain one, I like that one. Like I like the bounce on that one too. Okay. Like I don't know if you make your samples too, but like that, you made that. Mm -hmm. like, that's tough. And like that last one, I like that. I forgot what sample that is, but I like that sample. Like I really like that last sample. What what did you actually sound from there? It was a deal. Yeah, it was yeah. bothering me. I had to had to figure it out. But nah, you tough though. It's just like that first one. It was just kind of like I wouldn't call it organic, but it was like I just heard that. People all the time. Gotcha. You feel me? Gotcha. But like the drums on it was tough. I like how you switched it up too. And you had like that second hi hat into it. But now you are though. I think the beats you played are more like storytelling beats. Mm -hmm. Bring in the drums up like maybe a few bars sooner, so that way we can get to the action. Cause it's like it drops and then it drop into like another like subtle section, okay, yeah. and then it builds up. Yeah. But ain't nothing wrong with them. Switch up your samples. Maybe collaborate more. Um, with other producers, you know, if you don't really design sounds, uh, there's a lot of PLO driven mm -hmm. stuff. You know, everybody got their sound though. You know what I'm saying? Every producer got a sound, so if you gonna go the piano route and keep doing that, mess with your arrangements more. You know what I'm saying? Just expand, try to do something different. That way, like, if, if I was hearing your beats and you weren't here in the room, and I was like, play me some different, a different producer that I haven't worked with, and they played it, it wouldn't stick out right now. Curate your own specialness. I appreciate y'all, um, appreciate for the feedback, all that. Also, shout out my boy Go Go Charlie for the merch. I had to shout him out. Only beats. Wave check, you a fool. Wave check, you a fool. Y'all make some motherfucking noise with Wave Tech, man. Y'all make some motherfucking noise. Before we get back, bro, I want to introduce the people that's in the building. We always got tastemakers. We always got people that's here to work with y'all, producers and whatnot. I got an artist from Miami coming down. See, y'all make some noise from Prince P, man. My man to my man. Talk to the people real quick, bro. Um. What's good? Like you said, I'm from Miami. I go by the name of Prez P. I'm a rapper, you know, songwriter, all that shit. Um, I, I, I was watching what he been doing for the past few, you know, few months, Hadouk and whatnot. And I just told him, at the end, I'm like, bro, like, you got the plug on the producers, basically, so I'm gonna need you to air our something for me eventually down the line. And he was like, shit, that's crazy. That's something me and my manager been talking about already, so shit, you might just be the first artist we do that for. So he told me just come through, chop it up with y'all. I wanted to link with y'all. I'm mad I'm late, but... Fucking with Atlanta traffic, you already know. If y'all wanna follow me, it's Press P underscore B Camping on everything. Below, y'all make some noise, man. What's going on, Shamay Man? DJ Zoo Camp, Iron Fist Cook Up. We back in the building. Y'all make some noise! Y'all know what time it is, man. Iron Fist Cook Up, turning producers into superstars, making producers, breaking producers, the whole nine, you name it. And we just back in the building, man. So I got some heavy judges in the building and the judges I got, they billboard plaques, they heavy hitters, big taste makers. First producer, I, I, I gotta show love to him cause I've been rocking with him for a minute. Done made moves with Job Queese and Usher and he signed the producers now so you know he got a check. Y'all make some noise for K-Major! <laughs> Talk to the people, K-Major. Singer, songwriter, producer, CEO, working man, you know what I'm saying? We at the top of the charts, we working on everybody's album, we work with everybody, we looking for the new ways. We here. All right, now, the next taste maker, he just got a plaque today. Y'all make some noise for T.A.T. Talk to the people, my nigga. What's good, your boy? T.A.T. Producer, locked in, looking for new people to lock in with. I be collabing, so if you hard, it don't matter what kind of following you got, what name you got, you hard, we locked in. Y'all come crazy, you mess around. Make a hit today, go crazy, get plays tomorrow, for real. Come on um, with it. We here for stuff like that. Now these other two tastemakers, Maybach Music is in the building. He done done stuff for T.I., uh, Killer Mike, uh, The Game. He, a, he really a golden child and a living legend of Atlanta. Y'all make some noise for Sad L, yo! What's up, y'all? God bless everybody in here, man. Everybody who working on your thing, keep working. My name is Seth L. Young. Give me the tracks, man. I'm from Indianapolis, Indiana. Been in Atlanta about 20 years. Got records with Tip, Rick Ross. I mean, Big Boy from Outkast, Asian Doll. Shit, you name it. A lot of folks, man. And I'm just here to just show love here. I want to listen. I want, you know, to vibe out. I'm actually looking for artists, man. You know, I want to work with more artists. Less placements, more artists. So we can build something from scratch. So, thank y'all. The next judge, um... He really low key, and I just thank God he was able to pull up. I've been rocking with him since Big Country came. You have seen him from the bottom, he's definitely here now. He done rocked in with Rick Ross. He done moved in and made moves with Wale and um, Young Dro. Y'all make some noise for Big Country. Y'all make some noise for Big Country. 
talk to the people real quick, man. Yeah, man, y'all already know it's Deep Bay and L. Maybach Music, Double MG. Y'all already know what time it is. Being on the market, man, we holding it down. I'm out here just working, bro. Like, I'm looking for producers. I'm looking for artists, my damn self, and trying to hold it down. You know what I'm saying? I've been doing this thing for, what, 17 years. Grammys, got that going. Platinum is, whatever, whatever. The future don't never stop, so let's go. You know what I'm saying? Whoever got it, let's get it. Rapper, it's your time, little man. So what's good? It's The Real Mopa. Follow me on IG at the real Mapa, T H E R E A L M A P A. And I went crazy last time and I'm finna do it again. So let's do it. Yeah. Nah, I like the beats. Uh, everything clean, mix is clean, arrangement is clean. I would just say keep going, lock in with some artists and writers. You know, you're young, but still lock in with writers your age and more people that you can get in contact with. And keep collaborating, spreading the name. It's already there, it sound good. Yeah, you crazy with it, dog. You 13? Well, yeah. I'm 14, I just turned 14. Well, happy birthday, man. <laughs> it's probably a superstar artist you about to go to school with in high school. Y'all lock in and y'all take over the streets fast as hell. Like, y'all young, y'all got the youth run everything. So you lock in with an artist, you find somebody local or somebody you go to school with who rap, y'all gonna blow up. You being so young, like, you literally could just be with the next star. Like, it's just, and that's like the way to go. You come up with a star and like, y'all really stay together. Y'all going up as far as they go, you feel me? Y'all like really like like doing it together. Y'all gonna just go up. You feel me? Like you gonna create them sounds. So, but you being so young, finally make they sound. They may not even like know what they sound is, but you just help create it. So they cheated you out your sound though. You need to turn that motherfucker up so we can feel it. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, hard. You know what I mean? That's why I was yelling like turn it up so we really can feel it for real, for real. You feel me? So, but you got it. You know what I'm saying? Especially being at a young age. You know what I mean? You got it, bro. So I mean, I I rock with you. We can collab on some shit. I ain't I got my artist on show for day right there. That's my baby brother. To be honest. But we gonna all lock in and you know what I mean? Get some stuff going for real. Y'all better get ready for that. Cause I'm gonna go super crazy next time. Yeah. Give me your IG real quick, bro. Give me your IG real quick. Follow me at the real Mapa T H E R E A L M A P A. And I know y'all probably like, man, I'm not gonna follow. follow me right now. I know some of y'all, y'all ain't following me. Go on Instagram right now, follow me. You ain't gonna regret it. Y'all yeah. make some noise for Matthew, man. Yeah. I want to keep this going on the road. Going on, Total Production, all this from Charleston, South Carolina. You know, I'm here a lot. I do this event a lot, so I'm just here to keep this thing pushing. Shout out Coolish and DJs. Shout out Hadouken, main man. I'm just going to play y'all some shit, take y'all down south. <laughs> Thank you.
would like to hear some more uh, of your sample stuff. You know what I'm saying? That's dope. I like that feel. For right. you, when I'm hearing your stuff, your sample stuff is clean. Yeah, that first one was nuts, man. You came in unorthodox box yeah. in South Paul, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That was beautiful, man. I like the sound selection. I like that you just chose like a different bop and you chose like different drum sounds, especially on that first one. And I really like your style a lot. You make your sample? Nah, like your drums, like, like your, like, except for like, I think it was like the third beat, it was like, I would say like the sound selection on it, mm -hmm. it was like the snare, it was like real, like, and kind of like outdated, it was kind of like, dude. right, 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 but like your samples, like all your samples are crazy. Some of them, like, I think with the first, no, the second one, I think I felt like the sample was kind of like a little bit too much. Keep it still sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I got you. You know what I mean? So the artist can actually write find and you don't find, this, find that pocket because it's like you, you you doing too much, you feel what I'm saying? But it's still hard not to take yeah. away from your production at all, you feel me? But if you find something, some feel of, you know what I mean? Like just get a feel of the, of the sample a little bit and leave it open for the artist. It's just like it was just bouncing all over the place. But it's all though, I ain't taking away from it. Even the last one, the last one with those two, me and him just jumped up like, oh yeah, that's it. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate everybody, appreciate all the feedback. Definitely every time I come, I listen, I go home and do the work and come back and bring the heat. So that's what I'm gonna do. Once again, Frozen Productions, Charleston, South Carolina, Frozen Art, Freezes Christ. Follow me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Underscore Frozen, underscore production. Find me there, meet me there. Let's collab, let's get some good music. Y'all make some motherfucking noise for Frozen, man. Leather Jacket Assassin, that's one word, Leather Jacket Assassin. I come down here from Martinsburg, West Virginia, trying to do something different. I'm a new producer, only been doing it for like two years. I'm here to learn, so let's get it. I like the drums. I like the drums. Arrangement wise, like uh, I understand the genre. I just uh, we just did currency album. Um, it reminded me of some currency, but it just need more breakdowns, like more drops, like more transitions. You know what I'm saying? And if you're gonna do like the loop type of drum beats that you own, like try to throw stuff at the speakers, maybe like a DJ scream or something every now. You know what I'm saying? Just oh, more yeah. aesthetics to sure, just keep sure. it going, keep it exciting. Keep that energy going. Exactly. Yeah. Like your drum selection is oh oh oh. Like it damn near feel like the drummer like right over there. Like the mixes is nice, the drums is nice, the even the reverbs on the snares is perfect. So I mean, really just. Just pair up with an artist who fit, you know what I'm saying? Fit that mob and it's a wrap. Yeah. I see the sound that you're going for. It's just like, if you're going to do it, you got to do it. You, feel me? you got to yeah. master it. You got to like, because like you got, you know what I'm saying? You got the skeleton of it. Now you got to really just throw stuff in and go crazy. The song's hard. I can hear Benny Conway all them on it. But the only thing is, it just, it just holds still. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It needs turnarounds. Like, you can keep the same elements if you say as you were to put, like, I wish I could play some shit, man. I'll play some shit real quick. But, like, the turnarounds would be, because I be producing shit like that too. Okay. Like, drum roll. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Doom, 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 doom. And it can still. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nigga feel that doom, doom, doom. Nigga, oh shit. Me personally, if I was you, I'd be digging in Con Conway and all them deals yeah. like a motherfucker, man. I just shit. need to step out of my comfort zone. Yeah, fuck it, do it. You know what I mean? You know that's, what I'm saying? That's what I'm here for, though. Yeah, like, that's, that's, I mean? that's they lane. Just nice to be heard and come out of the cave sometime, you know what I mean? Um, but you can follow me on IG, at Leather Jacket Assassin, it's one word. Look for the LJA and the black background, that's me. Um, one thing before I go, I just want to shout out my family for being so supportive. I'm sorry I be locking myself in the room. This is what I'm doing. And I also want to shout out to my oldest daughter who's 
in boot camp right now. By the time she graduates, that's when she'll see this. But shout out to you. I love you. Appreciate it. Y'all make some noise for that Jagged Assassin, man. Y'all make some noise. What's going on, y'all? This is Six. I'm from Puerto Rico, 787. I'm in Florida. I'm just here to work. So we have here, this is a thing we do now called open your dog. What that means is if pretty much if your mix wasn't right or it's something that the producers feel, the judges feel like need to be open to see real quick. Not judging no producer, but hey, it's something that need to be shown. So said L said he wants you to open your dog. Open your dog. So you, to that beat right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Take it right yeah, now. Take everything off. Take everything off. Yeah, just strip it down. Let's strip that bitch down. Yeah. Snag on snag. They don't slap. Primary, ain't yeah. no reverb on them heads. Ain't no reverb no. on the master fader. So are you putting a reverb on each channel? No. It's some, bro. The only thing I normally put a reverb on is maybe a hi hat if I'm trying to get creative with it. But I don't even put it on the uh, on nothing like that. Turn up. more you know what I'm saying I would say like YouTube more on the things that you haven't figured out yet I can tell when you producing that you you just like you just haven't figured out certain things you know what I'm saying technical technical things like in the program making it where your 808 isn't muddy the reverb on the hi-hats uh, hi is creative but it's so many other things that's not going on right in some areas so you can't really appreciate what it is you know what I'm saying so like mixing the, uh, some of your beats and stuff and layering just things that you can YouTube you know what I'm saying like how to you know how to just study more. I, I do like that you said a reverb. Like it do, it, it does create like a different like aesthetic or a different texture. Um, but like like he was saying, just dig deeper into your mixes, and also just try more sounds, different VSTs, different you know just different vibes. Like you had the concept of like making a beat, but it was just like with the reverb and the way it was mixed. Like it was sounding like it was kind of like feedback on it. But like that was what it was getting. You know? Like because once you have a clean mix and it's just knocking, that's like. Even if the beat is average, if it's just knocking in the studio, nine times out of 10, like an artist can still feel it though. So like the mix is like really like the main thing. So when you playing beats, you want, you want that shit to be here. You know what I'm saying? It sounded like it was over there. And like you got the elements of doing everything the right way. Just study more, even too, bro. Believe in yourself. You know what I'm saying? When you playing that shit, when y'all get up here, man, y'all play that shit like y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm the shit. You feel me? Cause you got, you got it. You, you presenting something. You know what I mean? Don't lay back on it, man. Cause you only get one shot in here. I appreciate everybody. <laughs> if anybody like my sound, don't even ask me the word. Just tell me where to pull up. That's all that matter, my nigga. Y'all make some noise for six. Set it out, man. Y'all make some noise. What up, what up? Mr. Yeah. Red Spark in the building. One half of 1617. You know what I'm talking about? C, C-I-T-Y-T-H-K. Hi, I can. Get at me. The Hi, I can. 16, Come on, fool. And it's the real Mr. Red Sparks on Instagram. Like, we'll make, so we could just produce with anybody. We'll make, you know what I'm saying? Some on Mac, some on PC. So, like, anybody want to live, Ableton, Logic, you know what I'm saying? FL. We got it on PC. We'll fuck around with you. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah.
Michael Jackson could be on that one, bro. <laughs> Grief. <laughs> Y'all the shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. No critique. Yeah, y'all should just pull up to the studio tonight. <laughs> All right, man. With it. With it. With it. Got like three albums I'm working on. That shit sounds like what we need. Yeah. Hey, this is definitely this is get your contact. No. Hey, yeah. Nah, we're pulling up for real. Oh, we right. here. Shit. Right after this. Right. Yeah, we here. Hey, y'all yeah. niggas dope, bro. Like, yeah. Ross working on the album right now, so we're gonna, I'm gonna holler y'all. We're gonna put some shit together. Definitely. I mean, okay. Definitely. I was lined up. And oh, hi hi key. That's T H E H I H T16 at Instagram. And it's the real red sparks. The real red underscore sparks. Hey, you want on? It's two of us. The other one couldn't be here. He in Memphis right now, handling some business. Shout out to OT. Stuff you was playing, so I'm glad you played that last one. That's, yeah. that's hard. Appreciate Same you. Same thing, you know what I'm saying? We definitely got to connect, you know what I'm saying? With some other stuff, some yeah. engineering stuff too. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, I'll absolutely. get your info, bro. No, for sure. Absolutely. You got mine. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> get that too, bro. Shit. Hey, no lie. Just insert artists here. Like, yeah, that, yeah. Shit, that shit, like. Man, I got a lot of artists I fuck with, but it's like no major. Major, major, but yeah, like, nigga, we major together. Yeah, we rocking right now, though. Oh, real shit. talk, so like, shit happening, man. Like yeah. I say, we're gonna work up. I'm sitting here is one step close to it. Yeah, you feel me? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. I'm sitting here one step close to it. You got, you got people that can you connect with and just go. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, shit. Sure. I mean, I done mix all type of shit. So doing beats, this shit fun. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Yeah. Attitudes with beats is totally different than rappers, bro. Yeah, for sure. yeah. <laughs> rappers <laughs> egos is. <laughs> so, and then we got the hardest job. Yeah. <laughs> Coming up Absolutely. with the rappers is easy. Yeah. Think yeah. about a melody for somebody to like. Yeah. It's the hardest job ever, bro. Well, shit, sure, you can go on, follow me on all you on um, dot dent. That's my um, website. It's over. Probably got like 190 beats on there. And shit, I sell them. So just holler at me, man. That's shit. We working. Raw cacao powder. <laughs> what is cacao powder? What the hell is cacao powder? <laughs> the educators. It's like raw chocolate cocoa. It's got hella antioxidants in it. It's like really good for you. It's bitter, but it's like the purest form of like dark chocolate. Is it still coming like a burgundy bag? It could. I just, I'm gonna. Where do you get it? It's from? like, it's like chocolate, though, right? I'm getting this shit out of Coke. <laughs> this is not coming like some fancy bag. This is, you know what baking cocoa is? Yeah. It's like that. But shape is, I've been getting this drink. It's like, it's like, it's called a shake, but it has, I think it has that dates and peanut butter and bananas. Bro, you ever heard of RX bars? Yeah. yeah. It's the greatest granola bar on earth. Yeah. It's got like the gummy texture and it's dates, egg whites, cacao, and that. Like it's the same oh, shit yeah. in your shake. It's just oh, a little yeah. bar. That's my studio go to. I'm about to die in that bitch. I'm like, here's 240 calories and great. Nice. I like that you know the exact amount of calories. I, I'm on it. Yeah. I'm on it. I, yeah. I get bloated fast, bro. I can't wait to go home and eat some spaghetti squash, and some eggplant, and shit. That's how it is. TV, talk to the people real quick. Love introduce yourself real quick. Uh, yeah, absolutely. What's up? Uh, it might be TBD. TBD. Yeah. I don't know. 
That's it. All right, let's get That's to it. That's it. I'm cool with that. And make sure your volume is not all the way up. It's not all the way up. All right, I'm gonna dock it a few. Clean, you know what I'm saying? Everything is there, arrangements there, uh, mixes is there. I would like to hear uh, more melody, I guess, in some of them. Some of them I couldn't really catch a, a distinct like melody as an artist. Like if I was writing to it, I couldn't really hear songs on some of it. But uh, everything else is there. It's different. It's creative. Yeah, it's a wave. I appreciate you. I like it. It's real ambient. It gives me like a. Uh Go to like the bookstore type of vibe and you know it's like a real you ever seen those youtube channels where they got them got the little cartoon doing like this the little low, low yeah, yeah that shit that's yeah, the vibe again yeah, yeah i like that shit. sync placements for me you know what i'm saying that sounds dope i'll take some sync guys hell yeah <laughs> <laughs> change lives. that's all we get my first movie check boy i don't want to go back to music no more albums <laughs> to them oh man fuck them I think the criticism's wrong. I think. Oh, <laughs> uh, no. Thanks to them. Yeah. Tell them yeah. what you have for breakfast again. Oatmeal with, with cow powder. And I love it. Give them the IG real quick, bro. If you know me, you can find it. And if you don't, I don't want you to. Awesome. What's going on, Tyson? Cedric, man. Cedric, what's going on, man? What's going on, my brother? Legendary, man. The legendary founder broke my blunt, man. That just, I don't know. That's a sign of what? It's a sign of sharing. Yeah, give me the other half. Let me get that half. Let me get that motherfucking man. Damn. Damn, man. What's going on? Sorry to touch some motherfucker. Oh, man. It's your boy, Nature Boy, aka Nature Boy King, Bando Tracks. Fuck with me on Bando Tracks Beats. Log on to BandoTracks.com. Hey, man. Let's turn this shit up, man. I'm with some of the legendary producers out here, man.
shit hard. The arrangement's hard. I like how you taking trap and you really like making it your own with the pockets of the drums and stuff. You ain't really in a typical pocket, but it's still riding. Uh, yeah, I want to see you lock in with more producers uh, that's working on stuff, collaborating, be billionaire, people like that. Like, yeah, it's hard. Yeah, you came in like Frozen with that unorthodox. You came in Southpaw, like the bounces. It's nuts, you know what I'm saying? Like I didn't know where you was going, but I, I, didn't, I didn't try to jump out the car either. You know what I'm saying? I enjoyed the ride. Yes, yeah, I love it. When I was just waiting for that snare to come in, bro, that shit. Oh, yeah, you yeah, would've took my camera. The snare, the snare, you know what I'm saying? Snare, if you would do that for me, me. goddamn, put that snare in there. For sure. For the last jump, bro. We got them. Yeah, we gonna lock in. That's why I need your plan for, bro. Yeah. Say that right there. Yeah, exactly. Then exactly. you already know what time it is with me again. It's your boy, Nature Boy from BandoTracks.com. Our artists, if you wanna link, link, in, link in with me, you can link in with them Bando Tracks beats. That's on Instagram, that's on Twitter. Literally, that's on everything, man. I'm on, I'm on all that shit, man. Just fuck with your boy, man. Edge was on six, stand up. Y'all yeah. make some noise with Bando Tracks. All the producers that, that, that perform, we get a pick of all y'all with the judges real quick. Get a pick with y'all with, with and the judges real quick and then... I am this, come on, come on.